what's up guys welcome back to the channel today i'm doing a little bit of a different style of video i'm doing kind of a comparison review type video um, today i am comparing and reviewing the old slammer the first run socket bound slammer compared to the brand new lucid ice this one is the lucid ice bath stamp slammer i'm going to be comparing the stability forehand backhand and uh, let's get into it so first off i'm going to be throwing the first run orbit slammer um, i'm going to throw it on a little bit of ante and let's see how it goes and back in so as you can see that one glided a little bit and then fought out of it at the end now we are going to be throwing the brand new Lucid Ice Slammer, same one, and see how fast it fights out. So, as you can see at the end, it had a little bit more dump to it. Alright guys, so I got both of them back. Both of those shots actually ended up about five feet from each other. So that kind of shows the direct comparison. Um, I'm actually going to be throwing them now backhand. I'm going to release them as flat as I possibly can. And uh, we're going to see what the stability looks like. We're going to start again with the first run orbit one. Alright, you can see the stability there. A little bit of an early release, so let's try this one now. So that there for me was really telling. It seemed like the Lucid Ice had a lot more stability when you're throwing a flat. And uh, so if you guys are looking for something that is more stable, you definitely want to pick one of these up. All right, now let's go get them and do some forehands. All right guys, so I got both of them back again and we are going to be testing out the forehands. Now my forehand is not the strongest, but I still want to give you guys an idea of what these fly like throwing on forehands. I'm going to release it flat. A little low, but you guys get an idea of the stability. Now let's try the Lucid Ice. You could see the dump at the end there for sure. Definitely some extra stability on these new Lucid Ice Slammers. Now we're gonna try a little anti forehand. Uh, let's see how that goes. Let's see if we can get us some glide. That one glided a little bit, but dumped at it from the end. Let's try the Lucid Eye. Alright, so as you can see on that one also, the Lucid Eye is dumped out way faster. Not near as much glide. Alright, you can see that the Lucid Eye is dumped out of that pretty quickly. Definitely a lot faster than the first run Orbit. I want to do a comparison to the Zone OS because I've seen online how insanely stable that is. I don't have my hands on one yet. If you guys would be interested in that, leave it in the comments below and I'll try and see if I can get one. So now I'm going to see how far I can throw them as hard as I can and see which one goes farther. So as you can see, that actually glided pretty well. It went pretty far for a slammer. Let's see if we can beat it with the new Lucid Eye. No shot. I think that there showed how much more stable the new Lucid Eye's plastic is. If you guys are enjoying this video, please hit that subscribe button and leave a like on this video. It means a lot. Thank you guys for tuning in. All right, guys, here is the Lucid Ice. You can see my bag there. I'd say it went about 240-ish, 250 maybe. And then over here we have the first, and it probably went only about 10, 12 feet farther 
than the lucid ice there don't know the exact distance i didn't actually measure it out but it kind of gives you guys an idea on full power what these things will go so if you guys could leave a like on this video and subscribe to the channel i would really appreciate it also we're doing that giveaway on our instagram so go check that out it's really easy to enter thank you guys for watching i'll see you in the next one peace